hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel if you are new here welcome my name is ivy and i'm a makeup artist youtuber and content creator based in asaba delta state nigeria and in today's video i'm going to be sharing with you my top three high-end fit setting powders you guys requested for it and i'm here to deliver <laughs> that's the content you like to see then please keep on watching and don't forget to subscribe welcome back guys so i put up a video a while back on my few videos back rather on my top five affordable setting powders for oily skin and i had a subscriber reach out to me and was like ah those are affordable do you you know i find myself you know gearing more towards high-end things i feel like they perform better what are your recommendations for high-end setting powder and i was like don't worry i got you so today's video i'm going to be sharing with you my top three i don't have so much i just have about three i research properly because i they are high-end and i'm based in nigeria we don't cannot be returning things like that so these are the top three high-end setting powders that i currently own and that delivers well if you have oily skin these setting powders will work well for you they will set your makeup most times i use setting powders just to set the concealer underneath my eye and you know just bake a bit to give that brightness to my face i don't use that all over face powder i prefer the you know press powders for that um these powders i'm, I'm going to list with the oil they are very oil controlling because i have oily skin so these are powders that are targeted towards oil control and they set my makeup in place all day long the very first powder i have right here this was my best of beauty product for year 2023 and it's still going strong and this is from fenty beauty this is the fenty beauty pro filter instant retouch setting powder and this is in the shade honey 05 this setting powder is luxurious this setting powder is beautiful this setting powder keeps my face matte 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 at times even underneath my eye here gets dry like which is really really unusual because i mean come on so only when i have to use setting powder like i have to moisturize a bit more underneath my eye there to prevent that dry feeling but it keeps my oils at B. Now, according to the website on Fenty Beauty, they said this powder is a super fine weightless loose setting powder curated in eight sheer shades to perfect and extend makeup wear for that filtered photo ready finish on look, which is really, really good. It gives this skin filter when you apply it you know you've applied something me i feel more like it because me i have large pores around here i feel more like it even helps to blow out my pores a bit so this is the first high-end setting powder on our list today the second setting powder on our list today is from this brand huda beauty and this is the huda beauty easy bake loose baking and setting powder and i am in the shade kunafa now if you look at this powder i do not like that overly bright yellowy powders to set my under eye now i own one or two that you know that give me that but normally i would prefer my powders to be just two shades lighter than me and seeing that these are iron powders that i you know i have to make get the best use of seeing that i can't return this powders i always like to get shades that suit my skin they don't give my face that overly bright under eye highlight hence why i use the shade kunafa in this they have so many other shades but this blue shade i feel like goes better with my skin tone now according to huda beauty the brand it's written here that the huda beauty easy bake loose powders are inspired by huda's strong belief that the technique of baking is a key step to a flawless finish while ensuring long lasting melt proof makeup this extremely light and silky texture yes yes and yes again blends seamlessly into the skin leaving it matte 
with a hint of sheen for a luminous finish that controls shine throughout the day now with this powder i see the madness but i don't see that sheen i don't see that luminous finish i do not i will be quite honest with you on that the powders work to subtly color correct and highlight different contours of the face leaving a translucent veil of color on your skin and it's available in nine shades now with this powder i can't see that luminous sheen that they're talking about this gives me a matte 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 look and it helps to extend you know the way of my makeup it it gives me that beautiful absolutely beautiful finish and you know it's huda you know i bake with this powder and i have no fear that you know it's going to keep my under eye like really dry or all of that it bakes seamlessly it sweeps off easily it doesn't um hold on to you know patches on your face i've used this powder with almost every concealer i own and it works with all of them i'm yet to see a concealer that this powder doesn't work with but the second powder the huda beauty easy bake loose setting powder the second high-end powder on our list and we have the third and final high-end setting powders on our list and i have them right here and these are the laura mercier translucent loose setting powders now i have two shades i have the shade translucent medium deep and translucent honey now i used to own the translucent shade i ran out of that and i went ahead to get the translucent honey translucent honey mm, i think i would prefer the translucent the translucent honey actually because translucent honey gives a bit of a cast to it so i like to mix it with my translucent medium deep just to tone it down a bit and i find that i am more comfortable with that finish and this powder is beautiful extremely beautiful i feel like i don't know i love the three for you let me not just say one better than the other but this laura, laura messier powder she whoever laura messier is i'm figuring i think is a woman she knew exactly what she was doing now let's go on to the laura messier website and see what your claims about this powders are now the set the translucent loose is a certain powder this little mc powders is beloved for its 16 hour wear an iconic soft focus finish with zero flashback so the setting powder is laura's makeup must have to set and maintain the color of your foundation takes ex exceptionally new to deliver incredible staying power without weight or texture so the skin looks and feels smooth soft and flawless from day to night all right it's then um, what again it's in three shades for virtually all skin tones and especially um oily skin so that is written written there and they said it reduces shine throughout the day and about 85 percent of the consumers have corroborated this to 16 hour soft matte finish and they are insisting that it sets makeup for 16 hours of transfer resistant wear and about 95 percent of consumers says it controls oil all day long um you know there's, there's no flashback it's truly translucent now the translucent and the translucent medium deep i can corroborate is truly translucent but this translucent honey is not as translucent as i would personally prefer i feel like there's there is still a cast to it especially for my skin tone um it's, it has a smoothening in effect and it gives a smooth look to the skin that is true and it does not clog pores it's dermatology tested and you know uh, what does it say yeah, i think that's about it it contain, contains vitamin c and e which are powerful antioxidants known to support a more even toned complexion over time 
now apart from the claim of it being truly translucent i agree with every other claim of this powder i love 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 these certain powders like when it comes to high end they are chef's kiss so there you have it guys my top three high-end setting powders if you have oily skin now i have oily skin so most of the content i put up on my channel will be targeted towards those that have oily skin because it's what i myself have you know talking about products i have used i cannot go and buy or use a product that doesn't suit my skin tone my skin um type because i want to put out content you understand so it has to be products that I mean, I'm buying these things with my money products that work well for my oily skin so if you do not have oily skin I don't know you might want to look for a content creator who you know that is their specialty for us here on the Ivy Little Big channel we are more geared towards our oily skin girlies and baddies okay thank you guys so much for watching thank you for staying tuned till the end and until I come your way again next week remain blessed bye guys